What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Lorna Marie. And today for you, I'm bringing you what's inside of my pool or beach bag. <sighs> I'm obsessed with this, you guys. I've shared one of these like every year. It's time to show you guys again how I organize, what I put in here, all the new things I put in here. But most importantly, check out my new bag. I love it. It's so beautiful. It's elevated. I feel like it looks expensive. It was only like $26 or $27. And I feel like you could definitely see this somewhere for like $100. So obsessed but i'm going to show you guys everything that's in here how i organize it why i bring certain things and hopefully this will help you guys if you guys want to see what's inside my bag then just keep watching all right you guys do you see this bag it is so cute it is a woven bag i just love that it's like textured it looks so much more expensive than it actually was it has like this beautiful gold chain it has leather like straps it is not real leather because it is only i believe it was 26 dollars on amazon last time i checked don't forget you guys everything is going to be down below in one blog post it will say click here for links and i like post it five times in a row so you don't miss it but all of the links will be in that blog post down below Okay, so you guys already know, I gotta give you the aerial shot. I gotta show you how everything goes in here. I'll put it all back into so you see how I organize everything. And this is my beach and pool bag. I absolutely love having this packed and ready to go. It never, everything stays in here. It never leaves this bag. And I have a place, if you don't know, I'm a full-time RVer, so having things packed and ready to go is just makes my life easier because I'm always busy, always doing stuff. So. Even if I go to the lake or whatever it is, I'm on a boat, I bring this bag with me and I don't have to repack it every single time. And that may seem a little annoying to have to buy multiple things, but for me, I just like the ease and accessibility of everything. So first of all, I just shared this with you guys in my last video. I popped this in here. This does not always stay in this bag because it needs to be refilled all the time. So. This is just my little supplement bag. I have my stir, my stevia, just a few little things that I like to have on me. Some different drink packets, lemon, all that good stuff. So if you guys have not seen this video, I will put it in the eye above for you guys so you can check it out. If you hear talking and stuff going on in the background, you know it's summertime, so the kids are kids are watching shows and doing stuff, so it is a little bit noisy in here. Kind of looks like the black hole right now. So on the right hand side here, I have three pouches, okay? I love the fact that I can put these little Velcro, these are actually cord labels, they're for your cords, but I put my labels on them and wrap it around here and I think it's so perfect. So you can label bags like this without having to stick something on here, which I do have labels that do that now, so I'm gonna share those with you guys as well, but these are great labels to have for your collection, you guys. I'm definitely gonna buy some more. So in this first bag here, we have first aid, and look at this, everything is just, you can just grab it from the top of my bag and see everything without having to pull it out. Wraps and wet bags, wipes, you can, like I said, if they're in there, you just look at the little flap and you don't have to pull everything out, which is nice. They're labeled like that. We're gonna go into this one first. So this is my first aid bag. You guys know I'm major on first aid. I feel like first aid is so important, you guys. It's like the number one thing for me to have on the go. And I have a million. I keep one in my purse. I have an extra one down in here at the bottom. Like redundancy for me is so important because I don't want to forget anything. When I when you're by the water, you're at a beach or wherever, for me, tourniquet. And this may seem a little extreme for some. I totally get it if this is not your cup of tea. But this basically, if your leg gets bit off by a shark, your kid jumps off of a rock and they get into a major artery on their leg or their arm, you can basically cut the circulation off with this and they will survive. So this has been through a lot. I've never had to use it, but you want to be able to slide this around anybody's leg. So I'm gonna give it even a little bit more space. So this is actually ready to go. And why I say it's ready to go is because I can slide this through over somebody's leg or arm, pull the strap and tighten with this as I need to go. Because if you have it all Velcroed up, one second could mean somebody's life or death. So I think this is very, very important. It's up to you guys if you wanna carry something like this on you. And then I just have your other basic stuff. I have a, a regular Israeli bandage. That's for, you know, more minor things. I mean, it's for major, but not a tourniquet. It's not as crazy. But I have waterproof 
bandage, I have the gauze, I have giant bandages, I have bleed stop, I have sting relief, and then what else do I have in here? Oh, we have afterbite. I like having this as well. Oh, these are eardrops. Eardrops. We have Advil. Oh, this is a very potent sting relief. They get stung by a bee. So anything like that, I just kind of throw this in here and um, I have the bare necessities. It's not super organized or anything. It is organized because it has its own pouch and that's fine for me. I don't need to go too crazy. Oh, gotta put that back in there. Anyways, okay. So next up, we just have wipes. This is just basic different types of wipes. We got Tide wipes. We have Neutrogena wipes. We have hand sanitizing wipes. We have Clorox wipes. You can wipe your table down or your chair if you're in a public place. We have regular, these are more like baby wipes. And then we have some tissue. And then we have some booty wipes so you can feel fresh and clean. So if you need wipes, I got you. <laughs> then next up we have the wraps and wet bag. So if your kids, I like changing my kids out of their wet clothes before they get in the car because we're usually driving far places. But I have two different size wet bags here. They're nothing special. They're honestly old. So I just threw these wet bags in here and then I have a wrap. I like having a wrap. I'd like to wrap it around me if I'm getting too much sun, put it on my chair, whatever it is. This one's super cute. I do like to have that on me or I'll put it over my bag. If I feel like I want a little bit extra security over my bag, I'll do that as well. Okay, back here, this is my little mini EDC kit. I just always like to have it on me. This goes into all of my smaller purses when I'm carrying one. I have a larger one. I will link those in the eye above for you guys as well, but I have a, this would be considered my mini one. I change pouches if you're like, wait a minute, girl, I haven't seen that one. It's mostly all the same things, you guys. I keep all of this survival stuff in here, especially with the way the world is going. We have some sort of like grid down situation. You're in the middle of nowhere. Oh, it's just, I know guys, the world is crazy right now, but just try to be as prepared as possible. That's all you can do. That's what makes me feel good is just being prepared. So I do always have a larger one on me that would most likely be in the car. And um, when I have a larger bag, I carry a bigger one. So I keep that in the little pocket here. I also have a fan. I have another fan as well. I'm gonna go show that to you guys. Where did I put that? Okay, so here are two separate fans that I bring with me sometimes. I love how this one's beige. So if I'm like at a pool or something and I'm sitting in a chair, I can totally set this one up. If I want a personal fan, this one is like, an air conditioner. It is the best handheld fan you guys I've ever found. It works so good. I bring this to Disney World and Disneyland with me. You actually put water in the top here and it mists out water in such a fine mist and blows it towards your face that it is like an air conditioner. I cannot tell you how freaking amazing that is. There it goes. Okay, I don't know if you guys can see that little mist. Let me see. Oh, there you go. You can kind of see it in front of the black. Oh, it's, it's amazing. This is life changing. If you're gonna pick one out, get this bad boy. And what's cool too is it has different little tabletop settings. You can set it on something, you can fold it down like this, and then you can also like hook it onto stuff, which is really, really nice. So highly suggest this one. Next up we have, this is like my everything bag. So I just keep this in the front. Usually to be honest, it's like open like this so I can grab things easily. The only thing I'm missing out of here is bug spray. And I'm like, of course I don't know where my freaking bug spray is, but Sometimes we're like out of it somewhere else. So I'll grab it out of a bag and that is the case today. So this is a bottle I bought off of Amazon, but I just put my tanning oil in here. I do like to tan. It has a very small SPF. I think it's like SPF 15 or eight or something small. And then this is my other little thing. I love that these both come on carabiners. I believe they're both from Walmart, but I'll link them if I can find them on Amazon. But this is SPF and then we have hand sanitizer. I like to be able to grab these out of my everything pouch. Then we have tissue. I like to have body spray right on me. I have a Tide stick. Always gotta have a Tide stick on me. I have some different little drink pouches here. Love having different things on me. So like if I, if I forget this one, I have backups. So that's kind of nice if you put things in places multiple times. I love these cute little tissue packets I found off of Amazon. Okay, then I just have lip treatment stuff. I have like three lip treatment things in here it looks like now. So I like to have one that's neutral for the family and this has SPF. And then I like this one. This is a tinted one that I like to use for myself if I can 
but this is a Hanalei. Oh my gosh, it's so good, you guys. So I put that in there. So I like to just keep those in here. I'm gonna take that one out. I don't need three in there. I also have, always have Q-tips and floss just in case my ear itches and gets on my nerves. I have a mini sewing kit. I have a carabiner, rubber band, safety pins, all the necessities in here. Then we have this little can cover if we're at the beach or whatever. I like to just throw that in there. I have this little koozie just because I have it. I'm like, eh, just keep it in here just in case. Next up is this big bad boy. Now, so this is got a handle like this. It's pretty big. And I've been into like my beige thing, but I do like having the black inside my beach bag because things get so dirty with sand. It just looks messed up, you know what I mean? So so this is the bag and when you open it up, bam, <laughs> it's got all of the things. I'm gonna get a close up of this for you guys so you guys can see everything, but I just wanted you to, to kind of see the layout and how everything looks inside of it. So let me hold this up, but we'll do each row for you guys so you can see. Okay, the first thing I actually wanna show you guys as I'm showing you the first row is, let me see if I can get close enough. I don't know if you can see, but there's actually one label on top of another one. So these are cloth labels, like you put inside of shirts, and then I just put a regular label over top. Because it's sticking to fabric, I always get that question, and sometimes they do fall off, because I would just stick the regular label right on here, and I honestly just peeled them off today, because only two were peeling off, and I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna stick the cloth ones on here. And so now I know for sure they're gonna stay on here. So I just wanted to show you guys what that looked like, but you just kind of press them down really good. And these are not coming off, which is amazing. So in this first row, we have Lysol contacts powder and mouth, which I have little wisp and I have more toothpicks cause I cannot run out and some mouthwash because you know, gotta have mouthwash. But just in case my contacts, I forgot to stick my little case in here. Powder for sand, it's really nice. I like having Lysol spray on me just in case I feel like there's sickness going around. I wanna Lysol some stuff down. And then next up we have leave-in treatment and hairspray. So I just put hairspray in a bottle here. We have the It's a 10 leave-in. And then also check this out, you guys. This is pretty cool. So I found this at Target, this little bottle, but I keep my hair treatment in here. These smell so good and they work really great. So if you're just sitting there watching your kids swim or whatever, you can totally do a hair treatment. And then it kind of heats up because you're in the sun, so it gets even deeper in there. So love having that. Then next up, I have hair ties and bobby pins because sometimes we go places after and that's why I have the hairspray there and then we have a hairbrush. So just in case, I never get my hair wet girls because I just, I don't want to. I just don't. I have color treated hair and it's just not good for it. So I never go under. I know I'm so boring. Okay. And then we have another little mini first aid kit. Let me show you what's in here. So in this little guy, I got this from the Dollar Tree and then I added more stuff to it. So I put more band-aids. I put some sting relief. There's alcohol pads, just a bunch of extra stuff because like if that bag falls out or something, cause something always happens. I, I have it on me. So love that. Always keep extra of what's important to you. So next row we have dry shampoo, deodorant, and we have lotion. So I have Jergens. this is the color, the tan accelerating lotion, and then I just have some like lotion sticks. So these are like the little lotion things we have. I just have this secret, the one I could find, and then we just have Not Your Mother's Clean Freak dry shampoo. Next up on this bottom section here, I also have those labels that go on the zippers right here. So we have bathroom and then we have shower. So in this bag here, I feel like for me, this is super important to have because sometimes if you're at a beach, there are no toilet seat covers, there's no toilet paper, there's nothing. So I love to have a bathroom bag on me. I'll link that in the eye above for you guys. I did a whole bathroom bag video on what I like specifically to keep with me or on my day bag or in the car, but this is just another one. So I have multiple on me. So we just have some seat covers. I have, we have soap sheets. We have toilet paper roll. We have booty wipes and feminine products and that stays in here at all times. Okay, and then in this one, this is the shower items. It's just body wash, shampoo, and conditioner, and that all just stays in here. Now we're gonna start sticking this stuff back in here. Back, I 
All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed what was inside my Polar Beach bag. I had so much fun putting this together. They call me the kit queen here because I love putting together a well-executed kit. If you've made it all the way to the end of the video, thank you so much. It truly means the world to me. Leave me a beach ball or some sort of beach emoji and let me know that you did. When you guys watch my video all the way through, it really benefits my channel. If you guys are interested in any of the products, it will all be listed in one link. It will say, tap here to shop. Okay, and it will have the link for you. Click on that link. It'll take you to my blog post where all of the products will be linked for you guys. Thank you guys again so much for watching. I know you could be anywhere on the internet, but you chose to be here with me. Until next time, I'm always your girl, Lorna Marie. Bye.